The first task here is to plug the constants into the equations to see what we're working with. Here are the simple harmonic oscillator equations, and here's what I get if I plug in g equals beta equals 0, k equals 2, and m equals 0.5. Now we're starting from the initial condition. By the way, this transpose notation means take a row vector and make it a column vector. It can also mean take a column vector and make it a row vector. Now recall, forward Euler advances from the current state in the following fashion. It takes the place where you are, computes the slope at that point, and walks along that slope for one time step to get the next point, delta t later. We have all this information except for the derivative vector. To get the values for that vector, we need to plug this into this. And if we do that, that is we evaluate the derivative x prime v prime when x equals negative 1 and v equals negative 2, we get this value. And then if we stuff that in here, we get the answer. And if you do the addition right, you'll see that this one is the correct answer.